Hey everybody, Melissa here. So today we're going to look at how to take data that's been sent to us in multiple columns and put it into the same column. And then if it's been sent to us in multiple rows, we can put it in the same row. Now Microsoft has made this process so easy with two functions, two call and two row. I can't wait to show you how these work. So let's go ahead and get started. Here is a list of our employees broken down by the department they work for. And what we want to do is get all of our employees into a single list. Now how we're going to do that is we're going to go to cell G3 and we're going to do equals to call. And inside of our parentheses, we want to do our array, which is the range where it's looking. So we want to select all of our employee names and then we want to do a comma one to tell it to ignore any blanks. Close our parentheses and hit enter. Now all of our employees are in a single list. So two row works basically the same way. Our data is listed out in multiple rows across our departments and we want to get it into one row. So we're going to go to column B10 and we're going to enter our two row function. Our array is where is this data at? So we need to select all of our employee names. We're going to do comma one so it ignores blank spaces. Close our parentheses and hit enter. And now all of our employee names are listed in one row. And that's it for today. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more content like this in the future, be sure to click that subscribe button before you leave. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.